But you the one I want And you the one I need And you the one I want Yeah, you the one I need But you the one I want And you the one I need And you the one I want What's the deal, gang? Welcome back to our mother channel <laughs> Hey, we, I like how this look. We look like we eat some seniors in high school or something like that, right. going to a game or something. Right, I, look, I said I look like I have like a sporty day or something. But today we're about to do a photo shoot for this brand. You know, get motivated. Shout out to my people, you know, get motivated. Jack is fired though. And I got the. Y'all gonna see it. Yeah, we go. We going crazy. You but know what I'm saying? Zay, actually, you got a coat from them before, right? Yeah, I got a coat. That Letterman jacket y'all seen is, is red. We'll and we got, yeah, we'll put a picture of it. I know y'all probably so, remember. I really don't know how the, the photo shoot put. Like, it's really pretty much like, like David. He, he came to you? Or yeah, he came to me. He approached me with it. Like, uh, yeah, do you and your girl want to do a photo shoot? It's really like a video slash photo shoot. Mm -hmm. Basically, like us having fun and David Buster type. Well, that's pretty much. I'm gonna explain what's going on. It's uh, Dave and Buster's vibe, you know what I'm saying? A cute, you know, little fun like date. Arcade. Yeah, arcade, little stuff like that. So, yeah, um, he hit me up like, do you and your girl, can y'all do this photo shoot for me? You just got these jackets in and hey, hey, fire, you know what I'm saying? So, make sure y'all go shop with my people over at Young and Motivated. I'm gonna put the Instagram on there so y'all can follow them. I'm ready for this, I ain't gonna lie. This is our first together, like, brand shoot. Like, little um, yeah. work. It's our shoot. first time doing some little business together. So, but, I'm yeah, I have. I have the blue one on and i just did like a ponytail i actually totally forgot about the shoot because you told me like what a month ago yes and i totally forgot it was today and cheap birthday is tomorrow so i didn't want to have me like doing nothing extra so i just had her do like literally the same ponytail y'all just seen but it still look cute but i got my purse black jumpsuit Oh, Rickies. Rickies. I got, you know, black tea. I'm gonna go get me a fresher black tea from H&M when we get there. Yeah, probably gonna see a better one. Philip Plain, got the Y&M jeans, and I got my cherry, cherry red 11s. Y'all gonna see the full body picture. Yeah, Karen come with us, so Karen, your friend. Yeah, I got that money out here with, with me too. Yeah, we'll the big world time off here. Yeah, uh, the, uh, how they here too. It's gonna be some people with us, so y'all gonna see like behind the scenes. But yeah, that's the vibes for today. It's already what time. Late then. Zay actually Six. just landed today is 6 p.m so y'all probably just see like the photo shoot the thing going on so today will probably be a short day um after that i have to go to tammy to help her with cheap birthday like i said so y'all just gonna come along to the photo shoot and all of that but yo welcome back don't forget to like comment and subscribe and share and, and, share. Share. and follow us on instagram and don't forget to check y'all get motivated. Yeah, motivated so yo, we're about to head out the shoot is at 6 30 so no, it's 6 16 so. so we're about to head out and we'll see y'all once we get there videographer is here and I'm hurry up trying to get the H and to buy me a black tea. Cause this one dingy. So I'm rushing through the mall. I see y'all when we get. Well, I see y'all when I get back over on the other side. We got my nigga Day Money in the building too, man. Day Money say what up to the YouTube vlog, man. Know what I mean? North Carolina with my brother. Yeah, man. big world tour shit, shit, man. Bagging wings. Hey y'all, we here. They gonna talk that it was a photo shoot. It's a video shoot. So yeah. It's a mood video though. It ain't like a
you know we got legendary shooters in the building, man. Right, man. Somebody sweat hard, man. Man, we sweat because we working, man. It's hot as hell in here, man. Big, big young and motivated, man. Make sure y'all stay young and motivated out here, man. Make sure y'all tap in with my folks, man. We out here making big moves, man. Big trip, man. Yes, sir. We out here. Come on, man. Stop playing with it. So we just got back. It's currently 8 p.m. So what it took like close to two hours. Mm -hmm. Um, I enjoyed it. It was a little out of my comfort zone. Like they were like smile and be lovey dovey or whatever. It was a success though. I'm but, sure the video is gonna come out good though, cause the guy who do the, who do the videos, he actually like got good content. Nah, I can trust his vision. Um, <coughs> I don't know when we get it back. Like for them to see it. Um, you know when we get it back? When we get the video back. Oh, uh, hopefully. Or like when they're gonna do the video. Yeah, hopefully. He'll take long i hope or, that turnaround time is as fast as mine yeah if it's like before this video drops then we'll try to insert it but if not y'all can go check out his account right yep check out his page i'm sure to be on there mm -hmm. and lately i've been down thinking about you uh, and when you come around i let you do because every time you come around i'm in the mood and you don't never let me down you pull it through to be honest it ain't our time that's the truth but you the one I check them out so mine's is a medium if you like the oversized look i feel like size up because he had told me to try the small one on it was like fitted the medium one is like a little oversized i feel like i would have even passed for a large because uh, like, i like it like really big yeah um the it's just the, the size of the torso like this part is like kind of short my jacket is actually a bar and i usually wear a small so you pretty much got to size up like three times damn near so because mm -hmm. yeah I mean, well, two times because this, yeah, this is a large, but it's just because of torso short, it look kind of a little different. This is a large, so if you usually wear a small, basically get a large. Yeah, so I'm about to just take Karen some pictures and then I, I text Tammy like that she still want me to come because I don't know if it's like too late, but she hasn't responded. But that's pretty much it for like y'all. Like we said, it was just gonna be a pretty short day because I'm just gonna go over there and help her. What you about to do? I got editing to do. I went to Detroit and I shot 16, 17 music videos, so I got a lot of editing to do yeah so i'm about to get to work i already knocked out two so i got 15 left luckily music video is not hours long so it don't really take right, yeah, yeah take but it's like time. a lot of edits too yeah i gotta do effects and all that type of stuff so probably take about two three hours every video i'm gonna try to knock out two more tonight if possible so yeah tomorrow is cheese birthday and tammy is doing him a brunch so we would just check in with y'all tomorrow once we wake up for the brunch and all of that so yep for today good night to y'all morning gang it's the next day man and it's a great day man everything has just been working in my favor and i just want to give all thanks to god man pray or work so if you just pray man pray for the stuff that you won't believe in and have faith and it'll work out you know what i'm saying just just pray man so today i basically i got a lot of stuff that needs to be shipped off i was gone um i got some graphic tees and the sweatsuits can't the pink sweatsuits man the pink sweatsuits are crazy i got the pink ones and the yellow ones i had a gray one but they stole my gray one so i, I y'all seen it on him but uh yeah so basically I'm about to, I'm about to show you how this the process of me shipping well packaging and shipping out you know saying some products or whatever the case is i gotta actually go to the post office and get some boxes so i really need to go back outside but i'm about to eat real quick i probably go to the post office get some boxes and then come back but um today nana is uh at tammy house right now helping her prepare for the brunch so y'all gonna see the brunch today i'm just in a great mood man make sure y'all shop with whenimlonelyclub.com we got a lot on the way man they got this aliyah tea i know it's a little dingy i just got out the got out the dirt i mean not the dirt i just got out the uh, clean clothes basket uh we got oh man so many wrap teas man just i'm just in a great mood man i i love y'all man i love y'all i love y'all support it's just it's just a blessing to be here man i'm about to be 25 next month i don't know what I want to do for my birthday i'm just blessed to see 25 in my city there's not a lot of people that make it to 25 so just forever grateful man so i'm about to eat real quick and then i gotta go to the post office to grab some boxes for the sweatsuit and then i'll be back and we'll go through the you know the shipping process yeah my nigga trying to drop make sure y'all go get that new testament man right yeah 
here. Yeah. Yeah. Y'all go check out Baby Tron new album, man, the New Testament. I shot the video to 100 overall, so make sure y'all go spend that record. Video gonna be dropping soon. I'm about to get started and get all these packages shipped out, man, because I know everybody be waiting on their uh, packages, so y'all about to watch me do this. Um, probably put it in a time lapse so y'all can watch me package these up. I gotta print out labels. Well, I'll probably show y'all printing out the labels first, and then we'll get to packing everything. 1 too. My first artist, I'm signing. D1 got a baby on the way, and he gotta tell his girl, but he don't know what he gon' say. Cry myself to sleep, cause I can't see you with nobody else. Gotta change the way I live, just so I can raise my kid. I've been stressing about communication, secrets that I hear. Tears running out my face, but I still tell him I'm gonna go. to take it off time left so y'all can hear this song man listen to this song bro listen to what he's saying bro y'all gotta hear him out listen to what he's saying on this song bro. it's too real he's a storyteller mm -hmm. Just another nigga from the hood that feel misunderstood. He can how to keep up with the rules and keep on feeling good. I don't like to rap, but he keep people thoughts in my mind. He gave my heart to people that I knew and never feel the same. We not meant to make it out this beat, that's why it's called a trap. That's the money for the world, they wonder why I'm taking cash. My life is never easy, I'm not judging your words. They tell me to find the truth, but never even pass the torch. Give a dynasty, never by myself, I'm in the dark, the demons watching me. How you finna give me something back in and say I'm the black? I can make a one up for my roots, you couldn't see the pain. They might think the hood is cool, but we don't wanna carry guns. People dying, mama's crying, they don't get to raise their son. I was just a child when Wait, I had they to learn to cope with death. Nobody at the age of 9-11 had to cope with stress. Listen, listen to him, I promise I'm gonna blow him up this year. I'm telling y'all I'm gonna blow him up this year. Watch I tell you. On the lookout, man. The real D1. All right, so the packages are delivered, uh, shipped up, boxed up. Um, they on the way. We kind of in a rush, so we running a little late. The party started at two, was well, supposed to start at two o'clock. It's already 2 48. Um, I just got this package from my people over at Public Image. Now, I ain't know what I was gonna wear today, but now I do. Shout out to Public Image, man. Y'all gonna see the fit once I put it on, but I'm about to hurry up and get to the house and so we can get dressed and head to the party. Check out this sweatsuit for Public Image real quick. Probably what I'm about to throw on. I thought she sent too, but she only sent more. I'm ready to get to the one Okay, Public Image, yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Yes, ma'am. Oh, uh, she must have sent two different shipments. Cause this is, this is just two pair of pants. So it must be another shipment on the way. So therefore it's two, it's two pair of pants in the hood. So it must be two boxes. I'm gonna hit her up and see. And then we got the brown, you dig. I might just wear the brown you dig today with some pants in there. Oh, I got my brown for, yeah, I'm wearing this right here, yeah. It's on the floor. Make sure y'all shout with my people over at Public Image, man. Yes, ma'am. On um, Public Image. <laughs> hey, y'all. It's the next day. I already talked to them. I've been talking to them today. This is my first time talking to them. Oh, yeah. It's the next day. Um, pretty much i woke up at eight in the morning oh, i didn't even tell y'all from the last vlog y'all seen i was going through it sleep was messed up just feeling really drained tuesday of this week basically i basically stayed up for 24 hours like i didn't go to sleep 
and I just had to like force myself to stay up. It was really, really hard, but that's what I do when I don't have no other option. Cause um, y'all was giving recommendations like melatonin, that gives me sleep paralysis. Y'all was saying sleep teeth, like don't nothing help me, but staying up for 24 hours basically. So I did it, went to the gym. I felt like I was gonna die, pass out. I did like two workouts. Then I just kept waking up early at eight, Wednesday, Thursday, and today. So yeah, girl, been back. yeah, girl, been waking up at eight for four days. So hopefully we can get this. I don't know today, cheap birthday. Yeah, uh, it's like. But is it gonna be all? We going all night? I mean, it's his birthday. You know how we do. Yeah. Even if I feel like even if we get back late, I still need to wake up at eight. Mm -hmm. But yep, it's the next day. It's cheap brunch. Woke up at 8, went to Tammy House. We helped her with just setting up, cooking, all of that. What time is it? Currently 3.11. Yeah, so it's a late brunch for us. But yeah. we got dressed. I just did a little quick makeup. I kept this hairstyle in. And y'all know that I was trying to match me. No, I put this on everything. I, this jacket just came in the mail when I was at the post office. So it's just so happy. That's why I say, oh, you wearing brown too. I'm yeah, ready to steal that because I'm going to wear that with my off-whites. Yeah, she said she's making you a pink one too. So okay. your pink one going to be gonna be in, in, so in stock. So we twinning. Cause I got this brown skim set. It's a whole skirt. Y'all probably see it later. And I got the hat from the uh, from the uh, the game. Yeah, we so played. we matching each other with the brown. Mm -hmm. So yeah, we're dressed. We're about to head to cheese brunch. We we're just showing y'all our fits. Well, I was just saying hey to y'all. Haven't talked to y'all all day. And yeah, we'll see y'all once we get there. I'm ready to eat some good food. Me too. I've been saving my appetite. Yeah. So we'll see y'all once we get there. Bitches calling my phone like I'm locked up nonstop from the plane to the fucking helicopter. Yo. Cops pulling up like I'm giving drugs out, nah, nah I'm a pop star, not a doctor They just calling my phone like I'm locked up, nah, stop From the plane to the fucking helicopter, yeah. Cops pulling up like I'm giving drugs out, nah, nah I'm a pop star, not a doctor Hey, shorty with the long text, I don't talk to him. Shorty with the long legs, she don't want to yeah, last year I kept it on the tuck, ayy 2020, I came to fuck it up, yeah I, I want a long life, a legendary one I want a quick death and an easy one I want a pretty girl and an honest one I want this drink and another one And I'm troublesome Got my plate ready, got me some little waffle Bacon, little sausage, chicken, and some potatoes they put cheese in the eggs, so I couldn't eat eggs. They ain't love me like that. You should look like three on each row. Start doing the middle. That's what I'm about to do. I'm going to start up on everything kind of guy. Except my chicken, though. <clears throat> now I'm over there preparing something. I'm watching you eating right here. I'm just here probably record or so. All right, y'all, we made it to the brunt. It's my plate. Look, we really can't eat much. We on a diet. Got a little parfait. Let me grab a mimosa. Got a whole mimosa bowl. How the hell you grab these? You gotta take you gotta thing off. Slap the bottom part. Take it off, then. But we got our mimosa. Cheers, Karen. Cheers. Cheers. That is good. Mm -hmm. Perfect. So I'm about to eat, but this sir is done already. So yeah. All right, y'all. Cheers. I think I'm gonna hit. Right, Tammy and Jay gonna look too fast. Zay done. I'm gonna hit. I'm gonna hit for the five hundred dollars. Hey, Tammy, you got so I know we're gonna transfer the Henny or what? But two bottles of Bel Air gone. Gone. Nobody else got mimosas. Two chin in this bitch. Everybody should be. Worries. Mean bottles. Bel Air. We are mimosas. Pussy still good. Hey, turn on Mika. Hey, 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 hey. Hey, 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 Seventeen time cut, let's put it on the interstate. If all we want me to change, I don't keep my sneakers late. But it's cool, I got no bags. 7.62, we don't throw shade. What the who? Yeah, I knew what I was coming as the way for. And I'm going back the only way it's for. I want that neck, ain't no man enough. All that we can fuck, we don't get comfortable. I just put it out my ring like a royal rumble. And no matter what I make, I still remain humble. Hey, 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 hey,
After cheap birthday, I had a bad hangover, so I don't want to do nothing. But we're back, it's currently 11 a.m. I'm about to get my nails done, about to get a feeling. Zay has a photo shoot for his brand today when I'm lonely club, I think around 2 p.m. I'm not sure if I'm gonna be able to make it because of my nails, but I was in one of his previous shoots, so he asked Karen to be in his shoot this time, you know, have a little different model. So I don't know if he has talked to y'all today or what. I don't know, but I'm just not waking up. And Charisma is pulling up to the house. So sometimes she'll pull up to the house. Sometimes I'll pull up on her, but she pulling up to the house today, which is perfect. So, yep, yeah, I'm about to show y'all me getting my nails done. So, yep, yeah, let's get it. <laughs> Hold me tight, love me right 
What's the deal, gang? Uh, so, none of I've been getting our nails done today. Uh, and I just got out the shower and getting ready. So I got a photo shoot for my brand when I'm the only club that we about to do, me and Karen, actually about to be in the photo shoot. I got the yellow sweatsuits dropping. Um, that was probably gonna drop towards the end of February, but they are available for pre-order. And then I got this pink sweatsuits that's gonna be dropping for Valentine's Day. So we're doing that shoot with the, you know, photographer Dante that we always shoot with. Then right after we leave that shoot, I'm shooting out to Charlotte. I got a video shoot with my guy Black and Terry Rozier. I don't know if y'all know who Terry Rozier is. He played for the Charlotte Hornets. So we're gonna go out there, shoot with bro, you know what I'm saying, have a nice little time. Very excited today. It's been um it's been a great day so far. I dropped a music video with one up T called Individuality. I'm gonna put it right here. Y'all go check that out. Um I actually premiered in the video myself. But uh yeah, so that's kind of pretty much it just the rundown of what's going on today. So I'm gonna bring y'all along with me. Um now I'm not coming with me to neither one of the shoots, so y'all pretty much gonna be with me today. I don't know what she's gonna be doing at the house or if she's gonna be going somewhere else, but that's the rundown. I see y'all once we get to the shoot. Hey y'all, it's 3 30. I really don't know if y'all gonna see my stuff first, then say stuff because it's 3 30. I just finished with nails, my nails took four hours and 30 minutes like these were so time consuming every little line on there like she literally had to do so these took a minute so i was gonna go with zay to his shoot but i'm getting my nails done i was like pushing back to three so hopefully i can make it but yeah they had left around 2 30 because it's in greensboro so i wasn't able to make it so i'm not sure if y'all seen it already or y'all about to see it but they went to his photo shoot and i think he had some other stuff to do after but for me I took my hair out yesterday, so I need to do like a hair mask and, you know, just freshen up, but nails is done. I'm actually about to eat some quick leftovers, but just wanted to update y'all that my claws is done. And I'm pretty much just about to be chilling, so, yep. We made it to the shoot, man. You know, got on that pink thing. Make sure y'all go tap in. Yeah, got bad Karen in the building. My girl, my girl came through for me, man. She ain't feeling the best right now, but she still came through. So I appreciate little stuff. She got like some type of little little sniffles. I don't know sniffles. what that's about. But yeah, we here, man. We about to get to it. And then, like I said, after we leave this shoot, I gotta go shoot a video for you know T Row and them. So see y'all in a little bit. Frank nigga lied to a real nigga. That's just some shit that you don't do. I'ma stay right for my real nigga. That's just some shit that I'm gonna do. Fuck all the commas. Let's fuck all some commas, nigga. Let's fuck all some commas. Shit wrong. Yeah. 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 Yeah.
like we swore to Mega. Niggas say they stacking me on push out. We gon' call a Mega. Tell me the how the girls from the strip. They like post too. Good morning, guys. Been up since probably about 5.30 this morning. Been having some crazy vivid dreams, man. Ever since I stopped smoking, my dreams been just too vivid, you know what I'm saying? Waking up in cold sweat, sometimes can't go back to sleep. Today, I just decided to stay up, probably about to start a new schedule, waking up. Waking up about between 6 and 7, I don't know, probably 6.30. Get my day started a little early. Right now, I'm at Waffle House. Uh, no, no, not up right now, but I'm still I'm probably probably end up splitting this little meal with her. I'm not sure if she's probably hungry right now. Usually, she don't be hungry when she first wake up. I'm going to just grab something, something real quick before we go to the gym. Don't mind this hoodie. This is one of my workout hoodies. Yeah, I've been having these vivid dreams, man. Uh, they're not necessarily like nightmares, but they just seem real, you know what I'm saying? And I'm kind of able to control them to a certain extent. But, yeah, I'm... Uh, I don't necessarily know what they mean yet, but I'm gonna start writing my dreams down because how vivid they are, it gotta mean something. Yeah, so I'm just grabbing some food real quick before we head to the gym. Yeah, I guess we'll see y'all once we get to the gym. Nigga didn't trick me to do a leg day, bro. He talking about when we first got here, we're gonna do a little bit of everything. I didn't think five leg workouts, and I was just not realizing. I'm like, well, my legs hurt. Nah, nah, let me explain shit. You ain't Kevin Hart talking about letting me explain. I need to make a when I'm lonely club uh uh what workout fit. That look like my pants. Hey, y'all, we just got back from the gym. I look crazy. Um, this is my week two of the gym, like consistently. Consistently? Consistently. Consistently. Zay been gone for a few months, like on and off, like when he got work trips and shit. But the workout was good. I'm glad I woke up for the second week. So just gotta keep going. Karen about to make breakfast. What she making? Steak tips or something like that. We had Eggs. stopped at the grocery store and they had grabbed stuff to cook. I um, still got a little bit of breakfast that I had from this morning, so I'm just gonna mix the steak tips in with what I already had. Yeah, so been up since one <clears> in the morning. Cause my crazy dreams. I kind of already told them about. Oh, you already talked to them? Yeah, I just um, talked to them uh, when I went this morning to get some Waffle House and told them what I was what was going on. And I told them we we're gonna go to workouts. Uh, so I don't know if I'm gonna wait for the breakfast to be ready or I'm gonna just go ahead and hop in the shower. But we wanna like get the house back to normal, I guess. Like Christmas, we still got our Christmas tree up, like just all my Christmas decor. Which what a day is it? I'm Christmas really tree sad up. because I feel like it's gonna look not homey and it's just gonna be dead without the Christmas tree. So. Yeah, we still don't have the couch that we want. We haven't found that. Like, me and Claudia been looking, but the crazy thing, it all goes back to the couch we wanted when we first moved into this house. Like, that's the one that we've been having our eye on recently, but we still been looking, so. That's gonna be crazy if that's the one, cause it's like. We could have been did We could have been got it, but the wait time was like six yeah. months, but we don't went this long, but. Wait well, we first was gonna get that couch, it was like 6,000. And I'm like, I can, um, I stopped liking stuff quick. Mm -hmm. So I'm like, do I really want to pay 6000 But then when we've been looking at it recently online, it's way cheaper. And like, it ain't no crazy time. Like the wait is like 3000 online, I think. 
So I don't know, but yeah, basically more of the store is gonna look dead without our Christmas stuff, but we need to go ahead and get that done because February, I have like two events beginning of February. So you need to go ahead and do that. And Zay leaves Thursday mm. on another work trip. So yeah, today that's what we're probably gonna do. Just get the house situated. So we'll probably check out y'all with breakfast. Yeah, in a minute. All right, sure. Food is done. Steak tips, eggs, potatoes. Look good. Care. Zay, I don't know what he, he got stuff from Waffle House and then he just added what Karen made on top. You got like hash browns. Yeah, I got half browns, yeah, eggs, and a little bit of bacon. <laughs> I'm trying to gain, so I gotta eat a lot of food. I'm standing because I'm about to go watch TV in the living room. But I just wanna give y'all a bite. But after this, I'm gonna show you what you just been eating. Mm -hmm. So we'll probably see y'all uh, after I probably get put together. Alright, chat. You know it's been like six hours since we talked to them. You know it seemed like that long. Nah, I fell asleep. So he took mistake. a nap. Yeah. I've been up since 5 30 this morning. I didn't even realize I fell asleep. Yeah, he took a nap. Um, I got in the shower. I did take like a little longer shower because I had to wash my hair out. Yeah, it's been six hours since we talked to you. I didn't seem that long, but we're up. We're about to show you our little fits. We twinning. Yeah, okay, we got sweats from. You already know my people at Public Image USA. You know what I'm saying? We're on the twins, these vibes. So shout out Public Image if y'all want these sweats. Make sure y'all go cop. And then y'all can match it with one. It just come to sweats though. She only got the sweats right now. Yeah. And then you could match it with one of the jackets. You know, either that I'd be wearing a little zip up jackets. Uh, my shirt was a little baggy, so I'm trying to tie it up. Yeah. I actually will size you one. Could have got your hair small. It's still not like girls. But we're about to show y'all our little fits. Y'all already know what we got on. Y'all already know what we got on. Y'all already know what we got on. She was just sad about it because she wants this tree to still be up. This tree is but nice though. The, we kept the box so we would be able to store it. Um, we need like a bin or something to store these ornaments. I doubt I'll do a white Christmas next year. I feel like every year I probably want a new color because I'm extra. We'll probably use this tree next year though, but I doubt we'll use the same decor again. I don't know about my cocoa bar. Definitely don't want to take that down. I said we can go if you want to go look for stuff to put. Mm -mm, we got to take everything down because it's like a whole new holiday coming Valentine's. It's time to give it up. So. So we got all the ornaments in this container. It's still a lot of space left. We try to organize it. Um, I really don't know what we're gonna do with it. Tree look naked. Zay about to try to get this star down. And then the hard part, I guess, we're putting it apart. Cause when we did it, me and Claudia were struggling. Now you gotta mash the things together. Give me that, that thing, that rug can come in here. I don't know if like the other stuff, Little decor could fit in here. It ain't that full yet. We might need a second one for the other stuff that's back there. Cause that's gonna take up a lot of space, huh? Well, that. We should have put this at the bottom. Right. So it could have protected it. Slow. I mean, I think we're just gonna have to use another one for that other stuff. Okay, so I'll start at the top, be attention. Yeah, I think this is more so your job. <laughs> Cause that's what you can't write off. And then it's like fluffed out and you know, like a tree comes f like not fluffy. Oh, disconnected. All right, y'all, while Zay's taking that down, I'm gonna take these down. I actually just filled them up with clothes, but like we didn't actually put nothing in here. So it's clothes in here. Shirts in here. Oh, what? Oh, everything. This was more so for the core. We didn't push it in there. That do what we had to do. 
Uncle just came to get all our boxes too, so we don't even have like extra boxes for like bigger stuff. Cause then the nudist trees over there are like bigger. I'm about to try to fit as much as I can in here, y'all. How you doing, Zach? No, yet. <sighs> This is the stuff that was on the breakfast table. I don't even know what my original coasters are. To be honest. Was this cord on there or y'all put the cord on there? The green cord? No, the black cord. No, that's already on there. Like, that's what comes with the Christmas tree. Right. The only thing that didn't come with would be like whatever was connected to the wall. This stuff from the cocoa bar, which I feel like I could do a cocoa bar every year. So that's what that band is looking like. Kind of full now. On um, Coco Bar, we will have to like wash them containers, the mugs, this stuff, this stuff, and then them big trees. I really don't know where them gonna fit. So I guess I'll update y'all once they done with this tree. All right, y'all. Zay is done with the Christmas tree, and this Christmas tree is really, really messy. And look at his damn sweats. Nah, they mess. And he using my mini lint roller that I keep in my purse. We don't have it. And that ain't gonna be enough, maybe. That's mini. My little dusty too. No, I think it's because I was laying on this blanket. I went ahead and put the containers in this box. I'm so glad I kept it because I don't have no space in my kitchen for these extra containers. So I just put them in here for whenever I need, you know, some little cute containers. Mugs, I really don't know if I have space there. I have a lot of cups, y'all. So yeah, I took a few stuff out over here. Oh, my coasters actually are in here. Is it messy in here? No, not that much. You know, I had opened this because I was looking for a lid that was missing and I seen that was right here. Look dirty, don't need to wipe them down. So that goes right there with my roses back to normal. Zay actually had bought me some new roses today because they were dead. Two dozens of red roses, so pretty. So we just waiting on this man to take all this limp off. I need to go through them gifts. You said what? I wish it could be Christmas. <laughs> All right, child. Zay took the tree already, and I'm on the phone with Tazana. Say hey, Tazana. Oh, hey. Huh? Oh, hey. She's saying who she's saying hey to. Oh, you saying hey to my video, me and Zay video. I don't that. Say hey. Hi. We <laughs> Oh, uh, we got a vacuum on this mess. Look at this, y'all. A damn mess. Alright, so I'm about to put this stuff in here. This shit messy too. Huh? This thing messy too. We just got a random Amazon box. I had got a new package. That's what we're using. You gotta grab that other stuff at the top of me because I'm scared. I'm not gonna reach that. My cookie jars, I'm about to take my other cookie jars out and put them back. And there, and put them cookie jars up. My pantry look crazy. I don't even want to show y'all, but let me get my jars. So I gotta put the rest of this stuff to this box. I don't want to see another damn tree for the rest of <laughs> the rest of the, the life. Imagine putting it up, having to fluff it. I ain't gonna lie. I was thinking which part is harder, having a fluff it or a thumb fluff it. Alright, child, this is what our living room looks like now. Pretty sad. I took the Christmas pillows off. We did leave this little throw blanket because it still goes. Um, This area, clean. I just need to put my bar back together. But I need to go through the pictures because I really don't remember how it even goes. Then we got our cookie area. That one is pretty full. Oreo's gone. And I thought I had red candy and I didn't. So I need to order some because I can only order like the all red on Amazon. Um, so yeah, let's do my bar real quick. Alright, y'all. I got the picture on when we did the bar. So just follow that. So first the book. Oh, like this. These things in the back. I know this one go right here. I know it's been stuck in my head. I don't know why I get a perfect. 
kind of let's go to next for yeah. It's like the little things you put on the bottles. I don't know where it's at, but I'll probably just have to experiment. Then it's the shot cups. Three going up. Three on each row. I don't think I'm gonna do the cups that go down here. I don't feel like it. Um because I gotta find them and all of that. We'll do that another day. When they close together. Okay. Then beside it, the Henny. We only got one Henny right now. And this 818 bottle. I think go beside it. I'm not even sure. Uh, that part was already there fixed. Yeah, that part already looks like how it was. Three. So it's just the cups, which is four different cups. We'll do that another day. But this, for the most part, is done. All right, y'all, overview. That's back, this back, back, kinda. But yeah, kitchen back, living room back, draw. <laughs> so we're done. I'm, I'm still full tired. I've been in the gym. Yeah, he made you do arms yesterday and legs today. Yeah, so arms just kicking in, you know, it don't. the soreness don't happen until the day or two later. Yeah, um, Zay went yesterday. My gym schedule is Tuesday through Thursday. But we're done with everything, like we said. I think I want to clean my closet. It's like, what it's like? Like Tad, Manny, and Devil went through it. <laughs> it's in distress, y'all. It's bad. So I need to get it situated. So I'm asking Zay to help me. Mm, I don't know. And then Karen is cooking dinner or whatever. So, yeah, we're probably about to start on my closet. Um, I really don't even want to show y'all the before, but I'm just show y'all. It really just be like a whole bunch of clothes. Like when I get packages, when I'm rushing, when I'm getting dressed, when I can't find nothing. Just throw everything everywhere. So, yeah, we're probably, so yeah, we're about to head upstairs and get started on that. So, please don't judge me. And I won't judge you. Because things can get better. Oh, Lord. Bro, <laughs> where are you going? It's just clothes. It look bad, but it ain't that bad. It look bad, y'all, but it ain't bad. What time is it? Let's see how long it takes us. This happened on oh y'all seen it on um, New Year's when I was trying to find all, all, all them outfits. I'll start with putting your shoes, whatever shoes. Is. That's the easiest part. Right, well, yeah, well, We're probably gonna set y'all up, y'all, because as y'all see, we just need to do some cleaning. No token. I need some baby. You First time in a long time. Y'all, the closet is back cleaned. This is just like new stuff. I actually got a haul coming soon. That's some of the stuff. I got more packages downstairs, so I just put that aside. I got a Nikki pillow now, so my rug on the floor, but I don't know what I'm going to do about it. But We're done. Teamwork, make the journey work. Hey. All right, y'all, the food is ready. Um, it baked chicken, rice veggies this is losing weight portion then says gaining weight i just start eating like i eat ve certain vegetables but i just start eating vegetables like this was this zucchini and squash yeah i didn't start eating vegetables till we started working out what the first time we started perfect perfecto and I don't low key turn into eating like a beauty. Cause this ain't enough for me. Yeah, I call my mom and tell her I mean best. Like my mom used to make like a really big pot of uh, rice. Cause we love rice, but I gotta cut down on rice. She might be sleep though. She probably sleep. She be up though, but she probably ain't sleep. She ain't big enough though, she might. My bedtime is at 11. I try to go to sleep at 11. 
It's 10, so I got like a little hour. <clears throat> Yeah, I might be switching my schedule too because I was a little tired today when I woke up, but I felt like me waking up at like 6 or 7 is probably going to be better, like 7 at least. Yeah, I heard if you wake up like that early, like you get a lot of shit done. Yeah, I'll probably start waking up at 7. Oh, so, we'll check in with y'all tomorrow morning. Same stuff, hitting the gym at 9. And we most likely going to do the date book tomorrow, which I want to see what's the next date. Oh, yeah, and I posted on my story that I was sad that we was taking it to court now, so everybody's saying to decorate for Valentine's. So we might go see what I found tomorrow. Maybe like some little pillows, blanket, just a few little small stuff to add. Oh okay. yeah. Good night, y'all. See you tomorrow. I'm on the car back. What you doing? The hell y'all got going on? <laughs> Look, my your son <laughs> eating vegetables. About to grab a water. What? Yeah. Your son eating vegetables out here in these streets. No, no, I got you in. No, no, no. No, I'm saying, watch, watch me eat it real quick. Hey, Bro, no, no. Hey. <laughs> Eating vegetables out here. About to be 25. Okay. Gotta get my vegetables on. Oh, it took you 25 years. That's all right, too. <laughs> <laughs> took me 25 I, years for something. I just started to. <laughs> see, see, it ain't just me. It's the other BS, too. I'm telling you. That's right now, now put them in, put them in, uh, check them. Sure I kind of just started like, to. It just had some spinach, but it was like, the design with spinach, and she was like, <laughs> <laughs> Look at that face you was doing, what, Mike? <laughs> <laughs> I like spinach. <laughs> <laughs> I like spinach, it's just, it was damn tomatoes in it. Yeah. All right, y'all good night for real. Like... I'm, okay, nah, nah. I'm losing weight, so my portion's smaller. See, I got I got two chickens. You know what I'm saying? I'm gaining over here. Big game. All right, y'all. Good night. Tell them good night. Good night. Good morning, y'all. Man, these withdrawal dreams, I ain't gonna lie, they kicking my butt, bro. I just had another four dreams, like two vivid, vividly clear dreams, and it's starting to make me lose sleep, and it's kind of pissing me off. I ain't gonna lie to you. Um, I, I've been on Instagram talking about it on Instagram, and it's seeming like this is kind of what happens when you kick a weed habit. It's definitely not cool. You can't pay me to smoke another blunt. After I get over these dreams, I probably will. I probably will never smoke again in my life, bro. I ain't gonna lie. These dreams are. Some of them are like, some of them are scary. Other ones are like, this is too vivid. Like I, I'm not saying I shouldn't remember these dreams like this, but I'm waking up like three to four times out the night. You know what I'm saying? In cold sweats because of these dreams, man. Seeing faces of people, remembering the faces, remembering exactly what happened in the dream. Usually sometimes I really can't remember, but I'm seeing clear and remembering everything. I guess that's a good thing, but it's like fake. <sighs> Making me not want to go to sleep, so. I'm up again. It's uh, it's 6:53 in the morning right now. Um, I tried listening to affirmations in my in my headphones. I still had bad dreams, so I don't know. Maybe. I don't know. I don't know what to do. Maybe I can recommend something in the comments once this video drops. Hopefully by the time the video come out, the dreams go away. But yeah, so kind of going through it. Nah, nah, sleep. We go to the gym at nine, which is two hours. I honestly don't know if I'm having energy. I'm still gonna go. Yeah, so do want to update y'all. I'm in here working because right now it's the only thing I could do, is, you know, since I'm up. And yeah, so see y'all later. So yeah, I just decided to come to Starbucks, man. Just come and get me a little breakfast, a little drink, and work on the video. Cause I'm not going back to sleep. I can't cap. I'm not going. I done had enough drinks for today. I'm not going back to sleep. I go back to sleep tomorrow. Try this shit again tomorrow night. I'm I'm good on the dream for the day. I don't even want a day dream. I dream tomorrow. I dream tomorrow. So I'm in here working, about to finish editing the video. It's currently 7:35. Gotta go to the gym in like uh, another hour. So yeah, I'm about to work. I will see y'all once we get to the gym. Hey y'all. What's good? What's good? We went to the gym. We left the gym. We got breakfast. All of that. We're at Target. Trying to find some Valentine stuff. I got a Valentine's little event coming up but um a lot of y'all suggested to decorate for valentine so we seen a really cute cookie jar right here so we're gonna get that and then we're about to see what else we find but yeah we here gym with the whole crew 
Hey, 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 hey. <laughs> I get that one, Zane. Get another basket. You can look at the kids in the basket. He said, because we got the kids in the basket. They're about to say we can use these small ones for something. But that's so cute. This is something I wanted for Christmas, like a clear Christmas one, but they have it. So, so we'll, I'm out with the girls. Yeah. <laughs> we'll keep you updated on what the little decor we found. All right, we're grabbing this pink heart candle. This a whole little Valentine's section. We're trying to see what we got. Uh, where are they pillows at? Johnny got that one. But remember, I Should got them pillows. Just to, lay, just to lay it on Yeah. Like, spread them out? Yeah. What else they got? I don't think we really need to do, like, too much. Yeah, just like. All right, little kid. Grab my stuff. <laughs> I also got some cookie cutters. That's Tammy's. What's this, a candle? Yeah. Oh, it smells good. Huh? Oh, yeah, it smells good. I'm about to throw it at Karen. Look at this little candle. Nude. We're going to put this in our breakfast area. What is that? It's cute. Where are we going to put it? The way they got it is so cute. Yeah, that is Yeah, cute. but where's that container? Oh, but fucking $30. <laughs> Throw blanket and kitchen stuff. Chari, come choose which ones you like. Awesome. All right, child, we're going to get this one because we already, I got some heart pillows from this other store like a week ago, so it matches. And then Claudia don't like none of these. Well, this is the only option. You what you think? Two it's two heart pillows. Oh, okay. This is the only kitchen towels. We don't really like them, so... Maybe another store, I'm not sure. They pillows ain't all that either. I like the, um, those red ones with the little red white. So, that's everything we got. Some stuff Tammy, some stuff Miles. Yeah, I thought we was coming in here for one thing. They ass got, they got, they got the whole Valentine's section. You might just grab all these damn boxes and put them in the cart. Right, this look like a lot of stuff. Look what they buying me, haha. Like Cause he's a nice bro. Yeah. And then we're like, this you look stressed out. What's your problem? Two on candy. <laughs> all right, y'all. So we're back from Target. We got a few stuff. So I'm about to show y'all. Let's say about to hop in the shower. So we're gonna do the bar area. I know how we did it for Christmas. We're gonna do like a little Valentine's vibe to it. So we got these little drinks. They're for your gut. Hopi, Hopi. I'm not sure. Claudia and Tammy drink these. So. We got them because they're pink and they're good for your guts. We got this. This might go right here on this counter. It's Stop Cupid. Stop Hero. Cupid. Mm -hmm. And it lights up. Probably got to put batteries in it. Yeah, it needs battery, but it looks like that. So that's cute. Karen got some protein chips. So for the cookie jar that we found, we ended up getting these cookies. It's... um strawberry shortbread cookies and their heart so that's so freaking cute so i'm gonna keep my red velvets cookie still because that's like still valentine's like red vibes i'm just gonna move the oreo one so i got three of those hopefully it's enough this is the cookie jar so freaking cute it has a little heart i like how it's simple but cute this is gonna go on the bar which we're gonna put like valentine's candy in them so that's that it's like a mini version of the big cookie one I'm going to get in the shower right after this, too, because I washed my hair today, so I just got to wash up my body. We got this candle. I think it's going to go in the bar area. Just a pink heart. Valentine's stuff is so cute. Like, the pink and red is just so cute with the hearts. These is some milk, chocolate, and strawberry white chocolate drink bombs. So, y'all know the little containers we have for the cocoa bar. We're going to reuse some of those because we got these. And we only got three because not that many fit in it. This is some stuff for this other stuff I got planned. Karen got these down Coca-Cola lip smackers. We got the nudish heart candle. Cause y'all know the vibes over there is nude. Um, I think this is for my other little day. I got plants, so that's just more Valentine's candy. I'ma keep in there. Y'all, look what they freaking had. Veggie chips, mini hearts. Like what? That is so cute. And y'all know we healthy right now. So we like veggie chips. I like the spicy ones. I thought that was so cute. This is for my little day, for some drinks I'm going to make, cotton candy. I just went ahead and grab it because I know by the time I get closer to it, stuff going to be gone. Um, these is the hot cocoa spoon. We Remember, we no, we didn't have, yeah, we did have spoons last time as well, but this is cute. We got some cookie cutters. It's different shapes 
five different shapes. Um, this is for the bar area. I really don't know what we're gonna do with it, but I think we're gonna use it as like some type of decor. This is for the other day. I got a lot of stuff for the other day that I was telling y'all about, so yeah. Okay, we got our throw blanket. Let me grab the pillows and a few to show y'all the ones I already had. We got this Valentine's throw blanket. I got this for Tizana for the other day. It's a Galentine's Day, y'all, for the other day that I'm talking about. Oh, this open. Pretty sure it just opened, though. We would have noticed that. We just got two of those purses to go in my candy jar. And that is it. Let me grab the pillows real quick. All right, y'all. So these are the pillows I was telling y'all about. It's just some red hearts. We were out shopping in Greensboro maybe like a week ago, and I had grabbed these. I had grabbed these for the little Galentine's that I was telling y'all about, but I didn't know I was going to decorate for Valentine's, but it literally goes perfect. So this is going to be on the couch. So, yep, that is everything. I'm about to just quickly freshen up, probably throw a little something on, and we're going to get to decorating. Um, depending on how it looks, we're going to see if we need to run to the store to grab more stuff. I know we didn't find no kitchen towels. We didn't want to do, like, really too much. We just, you know, want to have it looking a little cute in here since y'all did suggest the valentine's the course so yeah we will see y'all once we're all freshened up all right so we back at home we just showered cleaned up she didn't got fine i didn't know she was about to get this fine i just put on some mom chilling so fine blow my mind so it's time for the date book yeah um we freshened up or whatever we're gonna see what the date book says but we're not sure like what's the vibes zay is gonna be in the photo shoot zay and karen at four yeah currently three so we're gonna do the date book and then we gotta mm -hmm. still put this decor up and all of that we're just gonna see what it say <laughs> the nature i don't like the nature the next date says the nature freak date go out for a whole day of outdoor activities find your local park and plan the activities you will be doing and what you will be needing you can go hiking kayaking paddle board and mountain biking etc take your pick a fresh a breath of air is always a good idea and you will bring yummy food and good comp and a good companion will make it even better that honestly sound like a summertime date so i don't know if you want to hiking yeah that sounds like a summertime date let's see what's the next one so we're gonna save that for yeah nature time. That any play. i'm sorry i'm gonna cut you off go ahead oh anytime it's a date and it's like a certain season or we're like this is called outside yeah we're gonna come back to it because uh, yeah we got a lot to go so yeah. don't move all right the next one is the mission impossible date for this one, make a list of things to accomplish together and see how many you can get. Or if you are competitive, write each other the list of what the other has to accomplish and see who wins. For example, find three pay phones, spot a mailman, jump over two benches, hug a tree with yellow flowers, give a stranger a hug, etc. Get as creative and silly as you want. How you feeling about that one? Is that one lame? It's not lame, it's just different, but it's just like... For right now. Like a scavenger hunt? It's like, what's the point of it? Yeah, it's not like no, like the usual, it'll have like substance. This it's is like more a, like an activity on you know, some just random. Zay's competitive. I don't feel like I'm competitive. I don't really care to win or lose. Yeah. I don't know what you think. I don't I want think, you to say it's lame just because I said it. I, I said that before you said it. Lame. Yeah, I it's said it was like, lame. It's just like, I don't see the reason. Sometimes the stuff be like a reason. like Or it has a purpose. That yeah. one's just like a... Just to do something. I don't know. Comment what y'all think. <laughs> Next day. Ain't no way we're going to three already. The factory date. Uh, find a local factory, brewery, or bakery that allows day tours and go on a little field trip. They're usually very entertaining. And if you go to a what? Is that brewery? A brewery. brewery. Yeah. Or bakery, they will most likely do some yummy, yummy tastings for you. That sounds that sound bad. Do we have that here? Yeah, it's North Carolina. I got shit like that. Bakery that, or a brewery that yeah. you can go like on a tour today. I can we can look call around and see. All right, they gonna call around and see. We'll get back once I call yeah. around. So I'm about to call around real quick. All right, so I found a spot and they said that they're gonna do like a little small tour for us. It's not pretty like really long. Yeah, not nothing so like long. no hour long. They say they usually do like the real tours on like the first and third Friday every month, and it's not Friday, so we're just gonna get like something small to just kind of describe everything that's going on. It's uh a, like basically like a wine distillery, so they're gonna you know of course explain what the wines are, the drinks, the spirits, or whatever. We t taste a little bit of it, and you know just walk around a little bit. What's the name of it? Um, the name of the place is 
Broad Branch Distillery, Winston-Salem, North Carolina. Yeah, and they close at 7, so we'll head there after the photo shoot. Yeah. I need to grab my camera, so I'll see y'all. The book. Um, yeah. We might as well just take everything with us. Yeah, we're going to take everything with us. I'm about to get my camera and stuff together. We'll see y'all when we get to the shoot. So, come to find out, I am going to shoot. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> I always come well prepared, man. I had to get my face right, because I already... This is my guy right here, but I know how stuff go, man. So I always yeah. make sure I'm prepared. So right? Zay is actually in the shoot. Yeah, so I'm actually in the shoot and doing behind the scenes. You know what I'm saying? And I'm, I'm doing the honest one. Man. I appreciate the bad family, man. You know? yeah, man. Bad Zay, man. I appreciate that. <laughs> <laughs> get the bag and fumble it, I get the bag and flip it and tumble it Straight off the lot, 300 cash, and the car came with a blood in it Blow mama a thot, and she got ass, and she gon' fuck up a bag Pull up to the spot, living too fast, dropping the dump in the stash In Italy, got too far, hoes they deal me Drop the top, when it's cold, but you feel the heat Be real with me, keep it 100, just be real with me Eat it up like it's a feast, they say the dope on fleek Fuckin' set pill on me, I saw my nigga, baby, chill with me them niggas that fucked in the back don't say nothing, them niggas a kill for me. Back as I count in my sleep, on fleet. Her niggas spin on that paddy for leave. Bitch, I'm a dog in my tree. How about the frog and leap? I put them bricks in the fender. My bitch, she walk around like she Christiana. I used to break in the ammo. They take up running like the game the temple. It's simple, I play with a mantle. Mama say she saw me on Jimmy Kimmel. Count the duckers up on mine and said we're walking with the rats. I'm looking crippled. Fuck on that bitch, then I tip Hey, y'all, it's dark, but what time is it, girl? 6.30. 6 13 so the shoot didn't end till 5 40 which is a 30 minute drive so that means we wasn't gonna get here till like 6 15 and they closed at 7 so we did not have time to go drop this little girl so she's hostage and we didn't really get her choice we told her she had to come with us because we wanted to make it in time to do our date or whatever and yeah which is perfect she can get polaroids because when it's like outside dates we can never get polaroids like cute ones to capture the moment so Karen is here because we ain't gonna drop her off and they about to close but we called them before and they was like it's good so we're here and I ain't never seen this in Winston y'all so I don't know yeah it looks cool I don't know where they found this at. I ain't never seen this in Winston oh uh, y'all never seen this before? no we never seen this so we're about to head in there and see what they talking about got you feeling loose who's aiming on the drone got you feeling loose who's aiming on the drone got you feeling loose who's aiming on the Liquor. So this it, is moon kind of moonshine. -ish. It is based. It is based on that recipe. But okay. uh, people always ask me what makes something moonshine, and I say it's illegal. Right. You know, it can be made from fruit. It can be made from grains. Mm -hmm. Whatever. There's no one recipe for moonshine. Our blueberry whiskey is smashing violet. Uh, we used unaged bourbon and Eastern North Carolina blueberries, freshly squeezed. Bit of a lower proof point. Um, so it's an easy sipper. Goes really well with ginger ale, ginger beer, things like that, but it's great on its own. Wine people really like it. It's a bit of a heavy wine, port or cordial on the mouth feel. For bourbon people, I recommend Frank's Reserve here. It's not a true bourbon, but it is an aged version of the Night Lab. It's aged for three years in three different barrels. It's a three barrel blend, excuse me, uh, at 90 proof. We also have a rum, old world pot stilled rum. We use molasses from Barbados, so it's kind of an antique Rhode Island sipping rum. We let it rest for three months and used whiskey barrels, which is what gives it that yellowish color as all the spirits come off the still clear like this. Okay, so a barrel will make it a different color, certain barrels? Yep, as these are getting into our longer, this was aged three years, we're getting into sort of other aged products. Uh, the one exception is if you use a lot of blueberry juice in there, it will, it'll change it to a purple color. All right. This here is our anniversary rye. It's a version of our standard rye. It is aged for eight years at 105 proof. So eight years in a new American oak barrel, straight rye whiskey, rye yeast and water. Super Collider is an apple rye. Now where this, the Smashing Violet has blueberries in it in the juice and the mix, the apples here were used in the fermentation. So it, uh, it is going to present like a rye, but the apples tend to bring out the highlights, the flavors. It's like a Sharpie, kind of like your hoodie on the flavors. It yeah. kind of brightens it up. It's our longest age statement to date at nine years, and it's at 110 proof. 
This guy here is my favorite thing we've ever done here. It is a stout rye, though we call it the wood exploration rye. Uh, it spent six months in a used stout barrel, then it was transferred into a shaved, toasted, and recharred red wine barrel, where it spent eight years, and it's also at 110 proof. So those are the spirits we have on hand. If you'd like to try anything, I can give you a little taste. You can try. She wants to try. Yeah, she's like, she, I've been, See, like, I've been to, on that. It's like, yeah. I, I can talk all day about whiskey. It's, it's easier to just sort of let <laughs> folks give it a little try. So. All right, I'm going to let you pick the one I'm going to try. All right, you said you want to try a few, so, yeah. oh gosh, let me see. I want to try your favorite first. Oh, you want to try it? Yeah, that, that makes it easier. Yeah, try your favorite <laughs> first. I went straight to it. Yeah. Oh, yeah. I'm to try yeah. your favorite. This is, this is really good. A lot of ryes have, um, it's almost like a, and I say this with love, kind of a burnt tire vibe to it, like a rubber feel to it, or in the flavor. This guy, just kind of sip it and get a sense of it. It, um, it's almost got a little, it's a little lighter. You chugged it all. He's yeah. supposed to like. Sips, he's supposed sips. to like. We used to take a shot to Henny. That was it. Nah, this is different. Nah, I still good. taste it though. If you if you take shots to that, you would be there because that I just yeah, took a shot that. of that. Yeah, it's 110 proof. It's, yeah. it's, 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 it's good. It's good. I like that. Yeah, it might yeah. Be it's, good. it's it's a nice spirit. I still mm. taste it. It's a nice spirit. It's very similar to a low rye bourbon. Bourbon's gonna be a little sweeter. Ryes tend to have spice to them. Bourbons tend to be a little bit sweeter, and of course here in the south you can't go wrong being sweet. Everybody loves the sweet, especially in the Yeah, that definitely give me more of a sweet vibe. Yeah, yeah. And then that one? Then I tried that one. I haven't tried the one you yeah, tried. Yeah, the rye. Tried one. Would this one give you wine? Yeah, like a stronger. Snoop Dogg. I love that he can make drinks. Oh yeah, that's our, we do cocktails on Saturdays. Oh yeah, that's like. And uh, you can we tell you how to make them at home too. For fermenters, we have four fermenters, basically one per day per week. And then the still, what folks are most familiar with is right there front to the right. It's a 750 gallon still. Uh, as you can see, like here's some of the grains coming up. We're doing a, a bourbon right now. So this is some of the grains that we do. This is the production area. As I was saying, this is our cooker here. It starts, we grind the grains out back. That's where our grinder is because it makes a holy mess and we want to keep it as far away from here as we can. Right. So each day we'll do a cook, boom, it'll come in here. This is our fermenter. The yeast will hit it and it'll start creating the alcohols. Next day we do it again. So today this one got filled. It's at 94 degrees. It's going to come down. If you feel this, it's wet and cold. That's the chilling system. I was just about to say, so you got to have it at certain, certain wines at a certain, I mean, uh, what, what would be the, the, not wine, what would it be? Uh, this is, um, in beer, they would, I think they would call it a wort, but okay. um, it, we call it a mash, the mash bill that is fermenting. So we'll bring it down to about 84 degrees. It's gonna go in the barrel or go in the bottle. It's generally here. So. It's pretty dope, man. Yeah, man, I mean, this is where we do our bottling. Everything's done by hand. We label everything by hand. We bottle them four bottles at a time, label them. And it's kind of hard to see with all this stuff in here, but it's barrels all the way back there. So it's like about 400 barrels, give or take. Also, the, like the darker the barrels will make it like taste different? Or is like, uh, how, do, how does that work? It, it, it varies. I mean, like this is a used barrel that we're aging rum in. I told uh -huh. you how we rested it in rum. This is, came from Heaven Hills Distillery. This guy here is was a brand new barrel. Right, you could tell Whatever's by the color. It, this is rye whiskey winning in 2018. So wow. it's about <laughs> four years. 320, so it's 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 almost five years old. Yeah. So in another year, it's gonna sit for a whole other year, it'll be ready to go. All right, y'all. Y'all seen us try a few. I don't know. This stuff strong, way stronger than him. This strong is we got a Polaroid in there, but it's loading. And then I don't know what else we're gonna get a Polaroid. Uh, we only got two, we didn't have enough time to stop at the store. But this is so cool and different. I didn't even know we had this in Winston, like what? Like, cute. Look at yeah. cute. So he just gave us like a mini little tour. I think I'm gonna buy a blueberry flavor whiskey. Just for him being really, really nice. Like the man that y'all saw, that y'all are seeing, he's really, really sweet. So I just wanna show some support and I'm gonna get one of the blueberry one. So yeah. This day is going good so far. I like this one. He said this stuff you gotta like. It ain't no shots. <laughs> this is 
that guy right there. <laughs> yeah. yeah. That's you, man. Yeah, that's me, like, holding for. Hey, y'all, we just got home. We actually stopped at Village Tavern because we was going to do dinner there or whatever. Y'all know we love Village. They said 45 minute wait. No, no, turn right around. She didn't even think about it. I'm not waiting 45 minutes. I'm sorry. So we just grabbed Jason Deadly, which is nothing special. We just, I got me a chicken sandwich, avocado, Swiss cheese, on wheat bread. What you get? You got a Club Royale. Club Royale. Which is like a croissant, ham. Turkey. Yeah, some Baby. whole bunch of other stuff. So we're about to eat our quick dinner. And then I still need to decorate for Valentine's. I don't know if this sir is going to help me. No, I slightly help you. Gotta edit. What you gotta do? I don't mind. I didn't know if we know. wanted to do some personal one on one. You wouldn't have been shit. Oh, yeah, we still have to do, put the date book together with the Polaroids and all of that. So, yeah, we're gonna eat and then we're gonna check in with y'all. Hey, y'all. So, I'm pretty much about to start decorating and just putting everything where it goes. So, first, I'm gonna start with the couch and just put the pillows and the little throw bl blankets since it's so quick. So, I don't even have. I'm about to try to find somewhere to set y'all up. All right, Chavi, y'all hear a noise in the back. It's this heater we got in the living room. For some reason, our living room doesn't get really warm like the rest of the house. So I don't even know what store we got these from, but it was a Greensboro. I don't know if we're gonna get like some other ones, but I'ma just, I kinda didn't know they was this small. So maybe instead of these gray ones, we can get some other Valentine ones. I don't know, I have to go to the store to see what I find. I thought these were bigger. Cause I've seen some at Target and it was bigger than this, but it was pink and white. So that's that throw blanket. And I'm pretty much just put everything how I think and then I'll call Claudia and see if it needs to be rearranged because she's the one that does the decor. I pretty much like to fold it in half and then another half and literally just throw it on there. It's smaller than our Christmas throw, but that's the cutest one we found. I like when it look like messy, but that's where I'm not doing it. All right, couch area. I definitely feel like some better pillows to go behind the hearts because they look a little dry, I don't know. <laughs> it's a little pop, but we're gonna see if we find some better pillows. So let's move on. Okay, we're gonna add the candle. Like I said, I'm just placing stuff how I think, I don't know. I think when my white roses die, I might do pink roses in here just for, you know, Valentine. So that's that little candle. I need to wash like the containers and stuff to put everything in. So that's what I'm about to do. Hey y'all, so I got the containers washed. I'm about to add candy in this one, which is these. It look like the heart's too big to go down. Yeah, I'm gonna keep going down. I got two bags. I'm not just gonna close. All right, so it don't go all the way down usually like my starburst do, but that's gonna have to do. Okay, the cookie. I usually like to do my cookies on um, with gloves, but I ran out of gloves. Need to order some new ones. So. I just wash my hands because I'm doing. We only got three packs. I hope is enough. Then depending how these look beside the red velvet Oreos, we're gonna um, keep it. They don't look right. We're gonna move. Look, it's little hearts, y'all. They're really small. They smell good too. This is so cute. This one broke. I can't really do these cute like I do my Oreos. So I'm just gonna place them. However. So then after this one, we're gonna do the candy. I don't like how some of these is broke. And we're gonna do the little bar area after this. Oh, and I need to find batteries for that little sun we got. So then we're about to take a little minute, y'all. I'm gonna check in with y'all once I'm done. All right, y'all, I'm done. This one is for me. Claudia said she thought she had time to grab two. So I don't know if she's gonna still like this one right here or she's gonna want to just have these pink cookies and then the candy one i don't know i'm gonna have to see um zay actually got up he was laying down 
He's showing to put batteries in that thing. And then I don't remember if she said that goes on here or the bar. And it's not lighting up. But y'all remember it just lit up earlier when I showed y'all on the trimmy button? Light up when, is this supposed to come off or you can cut that trimy thing off. So I think we're about to remove the stuff off the bar. And I just put it back. I knew I wanted to be lazy yesterday and I put the stuff back on my bar. And I'm like, nah, let me not be too lazy. I should have been lazy. Now I got to take all this stuff off again. So next is the two little containers. With these Valentine's in them. It's hers. Dang, it fit perfect, y'all. Alright. This is Valentine's pieces. I'm about to put these down here. So next we're gonna put the other two stuff and the containers we already have for the hot cocoa bar which i don't know if i gotta put out like hot cocoa powder again i don't know then we only got one pack because last time when i got the bombs i had got a few packs and only a few have fit And then these just go like that. I'm gonna be able to close this one. I don't know if it's gonna get stale just being like that. Who knows? Jose about to move all this stuff and then we're gonna start putting stuff on there. But I think we're missing a few drinks. Um, When we had went to Target earlier after the gym, none of us had our IDs on so we wasn't able to buy like the bottles we wanted to put on here. But Zay did go get a pink wine, but I think we wanted like two more bottles. Yeah. All right, Chelsea, I got my little thing again. Got it out. I did go ahead and put some more little cocoa powder. I had looked on Amazon because I was like, I wonder if pink marshmallows exist. And I found some heart ones that say it will get here Friday. But I'm going to wait to see if there's anything else that we need to order. Like Valentine's decor. Because I feel like we need like a little sign over here that say like Happy Valentine's or something. But we ain't got nothing. Or maybe I can go to the store tomorrow. God, I don't even know how this stuff goes. I'm just placing it and we'll see. Let me see that sign. Then I don't even know if she wanted that sign over there or over here. I think she wanted it over there though. I'm not sure. I think she wanted that over there, Zay. Put it beside the cookies. From what I remember. I suck at decor like well, how do you do that? I don't know how to place that. I think that goes over there by the cookies. Yeah, because we need like three bottles right here she said the, the other one's from target right. i wanted to go to home goods but running short on time i feel like they'll have valentine stuff yeah i don't know where stuff like, where do these hearts go like spread it out yeah we're just gonna leave that i bet you it's gonna be totally different the way claudia does it i don't know so let me see what she say all right y'all this is how it end up looking so we just spread those out. Um, she said yes to the pink marshmallows. She kind of didn't change nothing around. She said this sign came over here. I wish it light up, but it wouldn't be playing. We added cups. We need two more bottles. And she said we can maybe try to find like a Valentine's little mug to go somewhere right here. We added these little pink bubbly pink Moscato that I had in the pantry. So I was like, why not? So that's this little area. We're probably gonna go to Home Goods tomorrow and see what else we find. But it looks cute and Valentine's. Yep, and she said the same thing like me that pink roses. So, yep, we'll add a few more stuff to that. This looks cute. Then she said the same thing like me. We need bigger pillows behind the hard ones. So, yep, that's our little Valentine's decor. It's just something slight. It looks cute. We're about to finish this date book and add our little Polaroids and stuff. All right, y'all, since we done with our little decor, this is what it look like overview. The pink vibes, just a little. These are the Polaroids. I don't even think y'all really got to see them up close, 
but he actually let us take one like when he was giving us the tour and it just looks so cute like what that's cute and like we told y'all we only had two polaroids so we had to make it work so this is us when with our little tasting and then that's what the bottle i bought oh bring the bottle i bought Zane. thank god none of them came out you know how like messed up i would have been me so karen actually gifted me this polaroid thing that actually prints them from your phone so since this date like we didn't catch nothing um we didn't ever got it to work so i don't know i'm gonna try or get some or more. we can get these printed from walmart like some pictures or get some more and take a picture of this oh yeah it. maybe it's a nice bottle yeah i have bought that but we can print these off walmart it just won't be polaroids i got this zay in the back i got a little just pictures some of the bottle the little tasting so this day is gonna look dry so i think we are gonna have no choice but to print some off but i think we got two good ones so let's go ahead and add these <laughs> it ain't much adding to me the crazy thing about our day is like we have so many more dates to go so i say take these over there and then we're gonna the walmart ones like the printed ones that we figured out the polaroid or we go to walmart we're gonna put them over here yeah, you know, I don't do this we go nice. we're gonna be looking back like why was this date so dry picture wise all right so so far i said that the dorm room date was my favorite and the um kindness day which was the quotes so i said today was one of my favorites as well so we i have three favorites so far but i don't want to just be saying like this is my favorite but this is one of my favorites just because y'all know we're like into drinking and it's just something like totally different and i know we were saying like wine at first but it wasn't wine so yeah it was just like something new like we always say something new and just something different the taste was what strong yeah strong all of them this was like some one of the alcohols was like 55 or something like that percent yeah and he just basically gave us like a whole explanation and everything and it was just like new stuff that i didn't even know about and it was just crazy how he was saying like stuff been sitting there for like 13 years and stuff like that so yeah one of my favorite days i think because it's like the drink and stuff and kind of like the background to it of it or whatever well been some of your favorite dates the dorm room date of course the bookstore day was pretty cool. We got a nice Polaroids that day too. I mm -hmm. forgot about this one, the three course meal date. Them jerk wings was hit. We ate jerk wings like three weeks in a row. Let's go back down memory lane. Okay, it started off with the jerk wings. This was our first day. Three course meal. I love this Polaroid. We had the bookstore book date. We have a lot of Polaroids this day. Yeah, it's going crazy. Save for this one. Oh, I hated this one. Puzzle day, yeah, we, we almost got not we got into it, but yeah, it got steep that day. Hmm, of course, the dorm room. The day. dorm room day. I don't even remember this night. Inspirational yeah, quotes. Quote. And now this one. We got to get this book fixed. Yeah, I got to get it. Where I guess I. All right, we can write our little notes we'll show you once we're done all right y'all so this is the overview of the book a little dry book yeah so we put today's date we put the location this was the name of the place so what would you remember the most about today the marker is really light because it's supposedly a light pink but i don't know we put exploring different liquors that are outside of our comfort zone right here we wrote distillery mm -hmm. Um, we put whiskey tasting right here. We was tasting the whiskey, one, the bottle I bought. Um, so yeah, we wrote our little notes. I put today was again one of my faves. I like drinking and trying new drinks. So just tasting something that wasn't the usual was fun. Just shows it's so much out here in the world. No, no. Then what and you I write? put I'm not much of a drinker, but since I met Nana, I've become more accustomed to it. And this was by far some of the most interesting liquors I've tasted. <laughs> So, overview of today's date. So, this is pretty much the end of today. This is the end of this video. Yeah, this is the end of the video. Because they leaves tomorrow. Yep, I gotta go work. Yeah, so, we're just gonna go ahead and say goodbye. But, hopefully y'all enjoyed this week. It was a eventful Yeah, week. pretty eventful. Yeah. yeah. So, hopefully y'all enjoyed it. Comment down below. If y'all would like for us to keep the vlogs coming, all of that, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. And share. And follow us on Instagram. At Banana and at Zay. No, Banana underscore. And at Zay Primo. <laughs> so, yeah, we love y'all. We'll see y'all in the next video. Bye. Bye.
But you don't want I want 